Yum. Mm. What are you eating? It looks very tasty. Mm. I found this bottle of honey in an old cupboard at home. Oh, but then it could be spoiled if it's too old. I don't think honey gets spoiled with time, does it, Professor? Well, liquid honey does not get spoiled. And since the honey you are having is still liquid, it very well means it's edible. But Professor, what makes honey last forever? Honey has high sugar concentration. It kills bacteria by plasmolysis. Natural airborne yeasts cannot become active in it because the moisture content is too low. Natural raw honey varies from 14% to 18% moisture content. When kept stored in a tightly sealed container at proper temperature, honey will not crystallize and can last forever. Honey is also very good for health. Yummy! <laughs> Yum! Making my own paper cup is so much fun. And here it is. But your cup is a bit bizarre, don't you think? All paper and plastic cups are wider at the top than the bottom. The design makes drinking from the plastic or paper cup much easier. Try drinking with your chin up and head tilted back. Um, <clears throat> oh no. See? The more you tilt your head back, the more difficult it is for you to swallow. So, when your cup is narrower at the bottom than the top, you have to tilt your head back to get the last drop. So you find it hard to swallow and also run the risk of feeling choked. Oh no! <laughs> yes, the design creates a cup within the cup effect that results into a tipping point where the fluid may fall all over your face and your face would already be tilted back. So, using paper or plastic cups wider at the top than the bottom are safe and the best for drinking? Yes, that way you can drink the last drop without tilting your head back. Just tilt the cup. And you're less likely to choke. Correct. thinking? I was just looking at this bottle, thinking, what's so special about this bottle? Look at it carefully. Doesn't it look like a person with a head, a neck, and a body? A neck? Guess you've never noticed it before. But why do bottles have necks? Well, a bottle has a neck so that you can hold on to it better and pour the liquid with ease. That makes sense, right? Camels look so ugly with that hump, don't they? I wonder why God gave them a hump at all. Well, camels have humps because they are essential for camel survival in hot, dry weather. Where food and water are not easily available? Yup. When there is food and water, camels eat in large quantities at a time. 
They can drink up to 30 gallons of water in one sitting. The camel can then go without drinking water for up to two weeks and up to a month without eating. The hump stores nutrients and water in the form of fat, which is slowly used up as the camel travels through areas where there is nothing to eat. So, does the hump become like a deflated balloon when all the fat has been used up? Exactly. It becomes limp and floppy once all the fat is used up. So, camels eat and drink in large quantities as soon as there is food and water around. Oh! Ouch! What are you Why reading, Why are there Piggy? seeds inside Don't disturb fruit. me. Let's I'm ask reading Professor. about plants. Professor? Hey, Why did you know that plants seeds make their own 